Hello everyone. Today in this video, I explain how to make an OTG cable by yourself at your home. It is my complete OTG cable. This OTG cable works very well. You see it? This USB female port is connected to the micro USB male port. The micro USB port is taken from old data cables. This USB female port is taken from old MB3 boards. How is it? What is your opinion? If you like it, please like, share and subscribe my channel. Okay? Now we are going to see how to make it. For this mainly we need two materials. One is the micro USB mail port. It is obtained from all data cable. Here I cut the cable into a small length like this. The second material is the USB female port. It is present in PCBs like MB3 player, charger etc. By desoldering method it is obtained. Now we are going to solder these wires to the USB port. For proper connection first align in this orientation. In this orientation the right side pin is the VCC. Left side is the ground pin. The pin which is near to the VCC is the D minus pin. The pin which is near to the ground is the D plus pin. Okay, you got it. In this, in the case of this wire, the color indicates different pins. Red is the VCC, black is the ground, white is the D minus, green is the D plus pin. Okay. So now we are going to connect the wire to the USB. For this, first cut the wire at appropriate length. For the cutting, I use a stripper. Okay. Now it is the time for soldering. For the soldering, I use a micro soldering. First, apply some solder to the wire tips. This is a simple soldering mask. This is easily done by anyone which do not know electronics. Okay. Here I cut the wire ends, extra length of the wire ends. Now I am going to connect the wire to the USB. First the VCC. I apply the solder to the VCC pin and the wire. You ensure that the connection is a good one. Okay. Now next I connect the D minus. That is the white wire. Take some solder and then connect the wire to the pin next next that the green wire that is the d plus pin okay finally the ground connection okay i solder the ground wire to the ground pin okay now i done we done the soldering work it is look great it's a good solder mark okay finally you double check the all the connections finally we completed the otg making this is the completed otg cable but there is a problem these connections are bare connections so after some usage it get damaged but i had a solution this is called glue it easily protect the connections from damage so first i cut it into small pieces like this then place it above the bare connection After this, I use a hot air gun. This is help to melt the hot glue. Okay. You use it very carefully. If you don't have a hot air gun, you use a hot glue gun. Okay. This is our completed artich cable. But uh, we need some time for setting the melted hot glue so wait some time for setting the hot glue how is it what is your opinion if you like it please like share and subscribe my channel okay thank you